Hey y'all, okay, this is gonna be the last little message that I give, okay? And this is a little message about um, an experience that me and my sister had, okay? We were talking on the phone and she was like, I was telling her, I don't know, I think I was telling my older sister something, cause I'm the baby, so I be telling them, I be telling them stuff, and then then they be getting mad at me because they cause they like they the oldest, and they feel like everything that I say to them is like, ugh, and because they think I'm mean or whatever, they think I'm mean. They they don't think I'm mean, but like when I tell them something, it's like I'm not gonna beat around the bush with them, right? So. My, my, one of my sisters was like, "Well, you need to you need to stop disrespecting uh, your oldest sister. That is your oldest sister, and the way you talk to her is wrong." And I said, "Sophia, I talk to Brenda every day. I mean, oh, I didn't say y'all name. Well, whatever. I said I talk to her every day. I said I, you know." I mean, if I'm telling you the same thing over and over and over again, I'm going to get mad eventually and be like, look, man, I'm tired of telling you that. Like, just, you know, just. <laughs> so I'd be like, when they do that to me or whatever, I'd be like, and then I tell them or whatever, like how I feel or whatever. Then they'd be like, oh, you, you, you think that just because you, you think you know everything and this and that and that and this. And so I just be like, well, whatever. If, if y'all think that I think I know everything, that's why a lot of, that's why I be getting in trouble a lot of times because they be thinking that I think I know everything. But I don't think I know everything, but they my older sisters, but, you know, anyway. So anyway, so I told my sister... She, so so the other day I posted something on Facebook and but I told my sister like I don't know how I'm disrespectful to you because I haven't talked to you in over a year sister <laughs> like I don't even know whether you, where you're coming from with that because if you're holding something from my past against me then that's not good <laughs> so let's move on to the future and you know because I don't really talk to nobody I just I really just try to stay to myself or whatever so then you know, then they thought I was wrong for saying that. So I said, well, whatever, man. I just don't even want to argue with y'all no more because, yeah, y'all my big sisters, but that doesn't mean that y'all know everything. And then they'd be like, well, we got to keep an eye on you because you, we don't know what you're going to do next. And I'd be like, okay, well, whatever, but I'm not no baby. Just because y'all messed around and called me doll baby when I was three or whatever, or two or whatever, started calling me that name I I'm not a baby okay I'm a grown woman and I'm gonna make whatever decision that I feel is in my intuition is good enough for me so you know and however my opinion I feel and seek so my sister anyway that so she posted I posted something and she said yeah forgiveness is good especially when you don't hold grudges or something like like or something like that oh what I was like, what grudges, sister? So, like, that the, the, the moral of the story is, is that those type of, that type of energy, okay, because obviously it's, it's the type of energy that's bothering my sister that's making her think that I'm holding a grudge against her just because I voiced my opinion and she may or may not agree with it. And then I have to be Miss Smarty Pants because I think that I know everything. And then, like, I don't even know how I know everything because I haven't really communicated with nobody in over a year or so, you know. And then when I do try to call to make people laugh or whatever, you know, it always gets to the, the um, it gets to the um, religion type of thing. And I'm just, you know, I'm not, I don't want to, you know, sometimes people just don't want to talk about religion, you know, and then if you do talk about religion, know what it is that you're talking about. I mean, know the facts of what you're talking about and then don't downgrade anybody because if we can't lift each other up, then we shouldn't be even in each other's energy.
So that's, I think that's probably why I pretty much stay away from people that don't want to be around me because I don't want for them to feel like, I know, like, I know that your energy doesn't want to be around me and like, I'm okay with that. <laughs> But when you want for your energy to be around me, don't think that I'm just going to be like, okay, I'm going to just accept that because no, like I tell myself, I say, I just, I want to just go move away, like not too far from my grandbabies, but you know, and just be free because you know, my kids is grown now and You know, so yeah. Anyway, the moral of love story is is just try to communicate with each other because if y'all don't communicate with each other, then people will be really in their mind thinking that you have a grudge against them, <laughs> and you don't even have a grudge against them. You just in your own world doing your own thing. So communication is key, I guess, for that little conversation. Have a good day.